Hi guys, welcome back to one of my classes. Thanksgiving is so close, so I wanted to create something to uh, celebrate uh, Thanksgiving and show you how to create uh, one of the symbols of Cornucopia. We are going to create this project using Fusion 360. Step 1. To create the Cornucopia, we are going to use the loft tool. First, we draw a spline on the front plane with a curved shape. Close the sketch and start a new one on the side plane. Draw a circle of 100 mm in diameter that touches the spline in the top part. Then close this sketch too. We create then an offset of the top plane, creating it aligned with the ending point of the spline. And on this new plane, we start a new sketch and draw another circle, but this time with a diameter of 20 mm and again touching the spline in one point. Now we can use the loft tool. Select as profiles the two circles we draw. And then choose as rail the spline we drawn first. And the shape of the cornucopia is done. Step 2. To create the inner part of the cornucopia, we repeat the same operations we did before, with the difference that this time we draw smaller circles. Draw on the side plane a 90 mm of diameter circle. Then Create a new sketch on the offset plane with and draw a 10 mm of diameter circle. Start a new sketch on the front plane and draw a spline that connects the two circles like we did before. You can be sure if you are anchoring the circles if a light blue cross appears. Adjust the spline shape in case you need, moving the points and the handles. Then use again the loft tool and proceed like we did before but this time set the operation to cut. Step 3. To close the bottom of the cornucopia, we use a sphere from the Create section of the top menu. Draw it on the front plane and make it the same dimension of the external part of the cornucopia, which is 20 mm, and set the operation to join. And the cornucopia is done! Step 4. Save the project in Autodesk Fusion 360 Cloud as Cornucopia. Notice that now the new name has appeared at the top of the left menu. Right click on it to open the secondary menu and select Save as STL to export the file for 3D printing. Now that you have your own cornucopia, you can 3D print it and fill it with leaves, snacks, um, candies, cookies, whatever you want to celebrate Thanksgiving with your family. Don't forget to upload your file on kirakira.com to share your designs with the community. And in case you need, upload your file and ask us to 3D print it for you. Also check out kirakira.com to get inspired by other amazing classes that you can take. Bye guys, see you next time!